Welcome to Midnight Mule FPL. I'm Midnight Mule and this is a video for my team for Game Week 36. Now normally when I show this I start by showing who's done well in the previous week which would be Game Week 35 but that doesn't finish until later tonight and there's no chance I would get this video done after the last game and out before next Game Week starts which is actually tomorrow. So I'm splitting the video in two. So this is my plans for the coming game week and then tomorrow I hope to record what happened in game week 35. Hopefully that made sense. All right, let's have a look at my plans. So I have one free transfer and my plan since I wildcarded in game week 30 was to probably sell Ollie Watkins and bring in Haaland. So when I did the wildcard back in 30, at the time I said I suspect Watkins is going to outscore Haaland, even though most people actually kept Haaland and sold Watkins. And even though I think Watkins missed a game and a half through injury, he did actually outscore Haaland for about seven points. So that was lucky, I'd say, because Haaland also missed games. So yeah, definitely lucky, but I'm glad I kept him. Now, I may make a second transfer for a hit. I could take Aiden Nori out and bring in Gvardio. So I wouldn't be playing Aiden Nori this week. I would be playing Dallow, Man United away at Crystal Palace. So if I do this transfer... It's actually Gvardiol playing instead of Dallow. And Gvardiol is at home to Wolves. So it's a, it's a case of, is he going to score four more points than Dallow? Quite possibly, but I'm not absolutely sure about that. So I don't know about that one. And then earlier on today, we found out that Fernandez is flagged and are dealt for Monday. So I may take him out and I can simply swap him for Kevin De Bruyne. But the trouble with that is I quite like Fernandez and I wanted him for the double next week. But there's no point in having him if he is out. So I don't have to make either of these moves. I may make the first one. I may make the second one. Who knows? So if we look at my team and assuming I go for the Gvardiol move, I would have Haaland as captain. He's at home to Wolves with his mates Gvardiol and Foden. And then Vice would probably be on Havertz at home to Bournemouth with his mate White. Then Palmer at home to West Ham with his mate Petrovic. And I'd have Robertson at home to Spurs. And all of those, I'm happy with those players. And the last three are away. He was his Isaac away at Burnley with his mate Gordon. And then Fernandez away to Palace. Now, of course, there's a chance Fernandez is going to be injured. So it's a good job I've got a little bit of a bench. I've got Pickford away to Luton. And then Hoyland away to Palace. Now, Hoyland's not been great recently, and of course, without Fernandez, there's even less chance of him getting an attacking return. But I don't mind if he comes in. And given that it's the last game, it's on Friday, uh, on Monday, it makes it a bit more interesting, because I've always got a chance of getting a few more points. And then after that, I've got Dallo, and I've got Trippier, who's almost certainly not going to play. And then regarding the background picture for this tiny little video... I started playing fancy football back in about 1995, 96, I think it was back on the Telegraph then. And one of the big stars at the time was David Beckham. And that's supposed to be David Beckham because it's his birthday today, May the 2nd. It's supposed to be a watercolour of him wearing an old mule hat. So there we have a very short video of what my plans are for Game Week 37. And as normal, <laughs> I still don't really know. I'm almost certainly going to bring in one Man City player, possibly two but I don't actually have to do either move. And I'm also aware that Watkins, net, more people are buying him this game week than selling him, which I find quite interesting. All right, thank you very much for watching this. And hopefully I'll get another video out tomorrow saying what happened in game week 35. Thanks, bye. <laughs>